Hey everybody, Rob here for Southwest Florida Television. Happy Friday. I'm back for my fourth and final live feed this morning from North Naples, Florida. It's about 8.20 a.m. 79 degrees. And I am standing on the boardwalk at the north end of Area 2. And as you can see, it is just glorious. Beautiful blue sky. Gorgeous. morning. There's an osprey sitting up here. It's kind of a routine of this ospreys. Sits up at the top of this tree here. We saw it earlier in part three. So I can get you a little closer look from the boardwalk here. Looking out, we gotta turn that head. Good morning, Holly. Just going to take a stroll down the beach for a little while, turn around, and head back up to Area 4. Our friend Margaret Kenny is supposed to be here this morning. Go say hi to her. She's down here on vacation. The water is gorgeous. That water temperature is, oh, somewhere around 87 degrees. It's nice and clear, very inviting. Tide is slowly going out here. Oop, there was some snook. Right over here, there's a group of them. There's about six of them making their way down the beach. See if they come over closer to the edge. They blend in with those ridges so well. I don't know if you can see them there or not. At least half a dozen of them. Yeah, now they split up. They saw my shadow. Once that sun comes up, you can't. They get scooped by your shadow. They split up. There's a couple back here.
Oh, well. I mean, they're almost the exact color of the water right now. They do a good job of camouflaging themselves. I think the dolphins like to play with them. Literally play with them, pick them up, toss them around. come out here for sunset but the weather has not been cooperating lately horrendous thunderstorms in the late afternoons lately late afternoon early evening there are beautiful little white ibises here look at that look how gorgeous that water is So what does it mean when a white eye sees its shadow? National Geographic here. Should we going to do a U-turn? Just going in a little circle. Might have missed something there. gorgeous colors. Morning. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Yeah, that water is just incredible this morning. It's nicer than yesterday. It's looking nicer than yesterday. Willow bird running by me. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Those little reflections are cool. Those little reflections are neat.
looking great here right now. And I think we're gonna start trucking up back up to area four. Now if you can see the little seagulls up there chilling out. One of them here, plop down in the sand, resting. They always go clean themselves when I go to get a picture of them. Try to get you up close and personal when I can. Where'd the other ones go? back to our normal mode here. right down here. I'll come out of the shadows, darn it. Did not, it's hanging in the shadows. No sea turtle nests today, no new nests. No false crawls, nothing.
Beautiful colors, though, again this morning, up by Wiggins Pass, beautiful sunrise. Good morning. We did see some dolphins in our second live feed this morning, swimming into Wiggins Pass. That was cool. Came out the boardwalk here in area two. We saw our osprey friend perched up in that pine tree there. Still sitting up there. Still sitting up in the top of the tree. Yes, that gorgeous, gorgeous blue sky. You might be able to see it if you squint your eyes. Thank you for those stars. I do appreciate that. Stars, tips, awesome, thank you. If you are a subscriber to my Southwest Florida television page here on Facebook, you are gonna get your name entered into a drawing for another one of those beautiful illuminated sea glass wreaths that Donnie makes. giving you till the end of August to make up your mind if you want to become a subscriber. So if you get your name in there before 6 p.m. on the last day of August, you'll be eligible for that drawing. Those wreaths are beautiful. We're going to be giving one away next week. Morning. Supposed to have some bad weather again this afternoon. Yesterday, down where those condos are, there was a little mini tornado way down there, down by Clam Pass around 3 o'clock. Way down at the end of Pelican Bay Beach. way down, see if we can. I think you can see Clam Pass there, way, 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 way down there. That's all those condos there, that's Park Shore there. Can't quite see the Naples Pier. It's behind those buildings. Should be looking 
C4 Myers Beach too this morning. It's pretty darn clear. Pretty clear here. Give it a whirl. Give it a zoom. Pull everything in closer here. Wiggins Pass there. They got their tents set up. That's Barefoot Beach. Those condos there. And up to the north, got Bonita Beach. And you'll see a gap here. That's kind of where Lover's Key is when we see this, the gap there coming in. And then to the left is the south end of Fort Myers Beach and all the way up Fort Myers Beach. Doesn't look far when you see it like that, huh? Looks like it's right around the corner. <laughs> Good morning, Mr. Arnold. Well, every time I glance out in the water, I see, and I'll see a swimmer going by. It gets me all excited. I'm like, oh, it's a dolphin. No. Yeah, it's a swimmer. <laughs> Funny smell in the air here. I don't know what it is. It smells like a cross between some sweet smelling flowers and something burning. Oh, no Gary. No Gary in the skybox. I saw a fish jump out of the water. <laughs> saw the little silver flash. It's the third dropout today. T-Mobile. Just losing my connection. Good 
big old area for beach. Look at that. Just a handful of people here. Gotta love it. If I stand here long enough, something interesting would come, will come swimming along the shoreline here. Usually a school of snook, sometimes a little shark. I haven't seen any stingrays yet. I'm surprised, didn't see a lot of stingrays this summer when that water was, was nice and warm. There was times where we just had schools of them out here, schools of little sharks, schools of stingrays. I remember Roy trying to grab one of the little sharks by the tail. <laughs> Saw a dark spot out in the water. Thought we might have had something interesting here. Just a little patch of red drift algae, a little seaweed.
tracker going by out there in the distance. That's a big racing kayak. Good morning.
This is so peaceful here. So peaceful. Really few people. Our buddy Joe. Good morning. It's good. How are you doing? Good. Have a beautiful day here. Man, it is gorgeous. Man, it's so nice. Compared to the afternoons, we've been getting some I know. wicked thunderstorms. Boy, those storms are something else. That lightning's ferocious yeah. the past three days. Coming up from work the other day, big lightning bolt like maybe 200 feet in front of me <sighs> right down to the ground. Isn't that amazing? Scary. Yeah. Wait till you're driving and it hits a light pole right next to you. Oh, oh man, that gets your attention. <laughs> it's something else. They, but, I guess I had a little mini tornado. I climbed yeah. past. The when, other I, day. when I left work to the west, down by the airport, it seemed like there was something forming. It was really, it was a very weird sky. Yeah. You know? If it's a weird sky, that's not good. It was like a cloud was coming down off the, the clouds. Yeah. And I said, that looks like a tornado. I don't know if that was like the start of it or whatever. It probably was. It was just really crazy. Because that's how it was coming this way. Yeah. Yeah. But, Somebody got a little video of it from all the way up here. Wow. I mean, it's not far, just down by those condos. Yeah. Oh, so it was right around here when it, it was It really was visible? down down by the condos okay. down there at Clam Pass. Oh. So. Yeah, Katrina mentioned you fell. You okay? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm all right. So yeah, just tripped. Just tripped. Yeah. I'm not watching. I never pay attention to where I'm walking. I'm always looking around here like this, you know. I'm looking usually the opposite way of the camera. Mm. <laughs> Just not paying attention. How beautiful the water is today. Those colors are just oh fantastic. You can see right there, it's like glass. Down at the pass, it's all, I guess, because the tide's going out. Yeah, it's, it's kind of mucky, yeah. Yeah. But the further you go this way, the nicer the water gets, the further south. Yeah, I'm going to try to make it down to the end, but I don't know. I'll do my best with my foot. I've been walking a lot with my sneakers on, so. Yeah. Well, yeah. you know, that's not a bad idea. But you, as long as, I like walking in the water, though. I, still, I can't come to the beach with sneakers. It's too hard. Yeah. I go to the Kaiga Park and walk. There you but go. I have to come here, too. This is like, I don't know, medicine coming here. It is. It this really is, is. This is therapy out here. It's just like, just like Roy used to say, you know, all that serotonin you, yeah. you bring into your body. I mean, it's a double whammy. It's good for the body and the soul. Yep. You know, body, mind, and soul. Yeah. Something about the ocean or the water. That attracts humans. I it's don't know what, what it is. Well, supposedly that's where we came from. Yep. If you believe in all that. Well, my ancestors probably wouldn't have been too good because I'm not a good swimmer, so. Yeah, my they ancestors were probably like catfish or something. Yeah, they probably had to get out of the water quick. <laughs> <laughs> so we're not going to make it too good in here with the whales and stuff around. Oh, man. Yeah. All right. Have a good day. Nice all seeing right, you. All right, Joe. It's always good seeing you. Yep. Give my best to the boss. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Always nice running into our friend Joe. I mean Katrina. His wife Katrina, so cute. She works here. She volunteers on Sundays here picking up trash. Well, my friends, I think I'm going to call it a morning here. It's been absolutely beautiful. Beautiful weather, just gorgeous. Beautiful weather, beautiful colors, beautiful friends. What more does one need? Thanks for hanging out with me. Thank you for the stars. Those of you that sent stars this morning, thank you. 
Don't forget to tell your friends about our beach walks in the morning. Invite them to hang out with us. Those of you that are subscribers to Southwest Florida Television's Facebook page, thank you for making that commitment. We'll see what happens this evening. I am not going to make any promises. Two factors, it's how I feel and what the weather is like. I'd love to be out here though for sunset. All right, I'm gonna go see if I can find our friend Margaret. Say hello to her. I haven't seen her in a while. Again, thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for being a friend. Until next time, stay safe, stay healthy, and stay strong. Tally ho, my friends, tally ho. For Southwest Florida Television, I'm Rob Stan. God bless.